Hi. So I woke up today and there's a lot of news and updates on social media and, um, and it just feels like a heavy day. And I haven't been able to shake that all day. And so I'm thinking, I bet there are a lot of people out there that are feeling heavy today. So we've been in this quarantine environment for a couple months now. And on top of that, some news is coming out that's just really tough to hear. And so I just wanted you to know that we're in this together. Um, we are. I think there are a lot of people trying to do good stuff and be there for others in a time that maybe they wouldn't normally have the time to do that. So I just wanted to give a couple thoughts about oh, what I'm trying to do to keep my mental health and maybe some ideas from you as well. But normally for me, I love to travel and go to the beach. Well, not really an option right now. And so we are trying to do some other things. We're actually getting away this weekend. We're going to go to Sedona because I, I, it's just really important to get a mental break and to step away. So um, there are a couple other things I wanted, a couple ideas though that I had for you guys. Um, I, I say take a break, but give yourself a break, especially if you're in job search. I, it, I know it can be hard. COVID-19 is hard. I mean, it's a challenge. It's a tough thing we're all dealing with in some capacity. But when you're adding job search on top of that, it can be extremely difficult to feel like you are going it alone. Um, all of us feeling in isolation is maybe it feels frustrating and hard for those of us that are in isolation. But if you're job searching and you're sitting behind your computer and you don't feel like you have connection and guidance, that can be super exhausting. So understand that you, you're not alone. You may feel alone, but you are definitely not alone in this. There are people out there that want to help you. So connect with folks, try to call up a friend, um, go to an, a virtual event, but connect with people that can help you because again, you are not alone. Um, now, the other thing I want to mention is ditch the negative self-talk. And so that sounds easy to say, right? But sometimes it can be really difficult to do, especially if you're alone, especially if you're feeling in isolation. But seriously, think about like, what were you created for? You know, why, why are you in this world? What, what's, why, why are you here? What are your gifts? What are your talents? And remember that. And if you're job searching, think about what am I bringing to an employer? What, what value do I have? And don't forget that. I know it can be easy to say, oh, I didn't get that job or I never heard back from a recruiter. Who cares? It's not no, it's next. You're moving on to the next great thing. So remember what your greatest assets are because you are important and people do care about you. So I know it could feel lonely in isolation sometimes, but remember, and I've said this before, this environment and this time in job search can be hard and it can be a challenge, but guess what you've done before? You've done hard things before. I've done hard things before, you've done hard things before, and you can get through this. You can do this. Um, give yourself a break, be kind to yourself, and just, just take the next right step. Whatever that next right step is, maybe it's calling a recruiter back, or following up on an email, or making a connection on LinkedIn. Whatever it is, just take the next right step. You can do hard things together, reach out to people that can help you. And we are really in this together, even though it looks different for every person. Love you guys.